Wales of pain fill this homestead. Following the death of Brian Wendo, who was allegedly shot by a police officer during the Wednesday demos in Emali, Makweni County. Their only plea to the government is that justice prevails. For them, the sudden death of Brian has denied him a future since he was set to join Kenyatta University. <laughs> The family says Brian wasn't involved in the protests. His only mishap was to step outside after hearing a commotion. In the same county at Kilemo Hospital, the administration says they received the body of a 19-year-old and many injured owing to the demos. It is a pain that this family in Mulongo Machakos County is also wallowing in, mourning after losing their kin during the protests. Sikuwa shua ni fame gani. So vila wali ni explainia, ndio tukatoka, tuka cross hizo barabara, tukenda tuka mpata amelala chini, pale Catholic. So kuwa na evo, mini kumshika ni kasikia ki wanajoto. So automatically, ni kajua fini, badu aja kufoju, nge mshika ni kasikia ki wabaridi. Tukambio mtu wa motorbike, atusaidie tumbebe, tumpeleke hosi. Batisa kufika, tukamboa risasi mekwamilia kwa roo, hakuna kitu ingine nye itafanyika. 20-year-old Faith Wanjiru, a student at St. Joseph Catholic Tailoring College, is among four victims who succumbed to bullet injuries. Ni mtoto alikuwa wakunye, alikuwa na shona manguo, ni msichana alikuwa wakunye nyeke, hata tukikosa na kwa nyumba, ananye nyeke atu, na hiyo mambo tunarekebisha na tunaendelea na maisha. Hmm. Kama ni shinda ni yari kuwa najua ni kiwa na shinda na niyabe mamu sijali tutumie pesa nye tukonayo na tunafanya tu hivyo. Sasa jana asubui tuliachana na ya tu vizuri huwa na nietea chai hapa kwa sto na muachanga kwa nyumba tu. Na niki muacha hivi mimi, mimi huwa natoka mbele yake na ya naacho wakijitarisha akitoka natoka na chai yangu wana kuja. Na niyabe mamu nimekuetea chai mii ni meenda. Sasa ni hivyo hivyo hiyo diyo mtido yake. Wanjiru's mother Rose Wamaitha recalls receiving the news via mobile phone. The single mother of two says her daughter was not among the protesters and yet she's now forced to bury her child. Nilipigiwa simu mtoto amepigwa na lisasi. Sasa mimi kwenda pale nikafunguliwa geti tukaingia. Sasa kwenda huko tukaambiwa fee ameaga. Watu yuko na yeye tena. Meanwhile, the Independent Policing Oversight Authority, IPOA, has promised to investigate officers who have been linked to the deaths of protesters. Harriet Chimea, K24.